hello today I'm here with a new video and today I'm doing a tag video again I like doing tag videos and there is so much tag videos on YouTube right now and I think that is very fun so today I'm doing the tag makeup wishlist and I have seen this a little bit of everywhere um, but when I saw Daniel Schmidt 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 you should say it in Swedish with a Swedish yeah <laughs> I will leave her channel and her video down in the description when I saw her video then I decided I want to do this so here I am doing this video so this is 12 questions and I think we just get started question number one what is the very next makeup item you're planning on buying and I am planning on buying two palettes from Menagerie Cosmetics. I have talked about this so many times. I am going to buy their Feral eyeshadow palette and Dragon Child palette. And I am waiting for them to have a Black Friday sale. Because Black Friday is coming up. And in Sweden that is that has been a big thing like the last two or three years. Before that we didn't have a Black Friday. And so it's it's pretty new to me. I like never sh waiting to buy something for Black Friday because in Sweden it's not so popular. It's starting to get it, but it's not it's not the like the U.S. Black Friday. But I hope that Menagerie Cosmetics will have some deal on Black Friday, and then I will buy these two palettes. So. That is my next buy. Question number two is, if you could walk into Sephora today and buy any one item regardless of budget, what would it be? And I will would go in and buy like the most expensive skincare product they have. Um, either a serum or a day cream, I think a serum. Or a face mask. And <laughs> I would like to test if it is that good. If it's worth the money. The downside with that is if it is that good and I fall in love, I have to buy it again. So I would go in and take like the most expensive serum that Sephora has. Question number three is what is the oldest item on your Sephora loves list? And Sephora in Sweden is not so big. We have five stores, I think. Or is it only four? And I don't live in the con in the country. <laughs> In the town where Sephora is and their website is pretty new and I don't think you can have a love list at Sephora Sweden I have no idea because I don't shop from Sephora that often because I don't really like Sephora that much not the Swedish Sephora but one thing I really want to buy from Sephora is one of the kilowatts highlighter from Fenty Beauty uh, I haven't bought any of them, but I want to buy them. But I don't know which one, and I don't know if I'm going to use it as much. But I really want to try them, but I haven't bought them. But I have, every time I have been to a Sephora, I have gotten to the Fenty shelf and like doing like this in every kilowatt highlight there is. But I don't know which one I want, but I want to try them, but yeah, I have never bought one and I want to try them. And I have wanted to try them as long as they have been at Sephora. And number five, what perfume is on top of your wish list? And I don't have a specific perfume, but I have a brand that I really love and it's Viredo. I think it is a Swedish brand. I have one of their perfume um, in the smell Bibliotheque. And that is like the smell of my life. It's the most expensive perfume I have ever bought. And it's the best perfume I know. I love the smell. And I would love to have another scent from them. But they are only in stores. You can buy them online. But I will never buy a perfume online if I can't smell it first. Um, and... I think they're only in stores in the two biggest cities in Sweden. So I have to go to one of them and smell it. And then buy it. But I want some more scent from Biredo. Because they 
their perfumes they are so good and the bottle is like the most fanciest bottle I have ever seen uh, yeah this is the perfume I have obviously so I want some new scent from Burero number six what is the new release you are looking most forward to and that is blush tribe and paulina blush tribe and paulina palette i am so i going to have it if i don't get my hands of it i don't know what i will do because i really 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 want that palette i need to have it because i i love paulina i have followed her for a couple of years now and I love Blush Tribe and when she was getting told the news that she was doing a palette I like I gonna buy it I don't care what it looks like I want that palette so I'm so looking forward to it it's released on the 1st of December the pre-sale and I'm going to like update the website and I'm going to buy that palette because I need it in my life uh, number seven is are there any drugstore products you want to have you want but haven't pulled the trigger on and in Sweden we don't like have the typical drugstore like it's in the UK or the USA we don't have that but one more drugstore brand I want to test the product from or buy a product from is NYX I have a lot of NYX makeup but I want to try their new suede matte lipstick because I like I love the liquid suede lipstick and I love the pe lip pencils that is suede and I want one of the lipsticks but I don't know which color I have like swatched all the colors but I can't decide but I really want NYX suede matte suede lipstick lipstick matte suede suede matte lipstick I really want one but I haven't bought it yet and I don't know why Question number eight. The eyeshadow palette you are lusting over most. And it's... I've, maybe it's the Menagerie Cosmetics, the Ferro palette, or the Dragon Child, or the Paulina palette. I don't know. One of these three palettes because I want them so, so bad. Product number nine. Question number nine. Product you are waiting for your next birthday Christmas to ask for. Uh, and I don't know, I usually don't wish for makeup, I usually just buy the makeup I want um, because uh, I, I wish for other things. Um, but something beauty related I want to wish for, like for Christmas, because it soon is Christmas, I want an eyelash extension or a lash lift. I think I'm going to do buy it myself, I don't know, or if I will wish for it, I don't know. But I want to fix my lashes. Because I have blonde lashes, I have tried to color them at home. It didn't work at all, it didn't happen anything. And I want I want more I want more lashes all the time because I have like blonde lashes and I want them to show all the time so I don't know if I'm going to buy it myself or if I'm going to wish for it a lash lift or a lash extension I think I will go with lash lift because lash extension you have to cherish a little bit and I don't know if I have the time and the money for it but I think some of one of these two I think I will ask for for Christmas maybe or I buy it myself I don't know Question number 10. What is the item you are dying to have that is not available in your country or your era? And I don't know... Almost everything you can ship to Sweden. It's just that it is so expensive. And when I haven't found anything that I want but I can't get. Um, that doesn't ship to Sweden. So no, I, I think I will, things I want to, this is not like a 
the real answer to this question or the right answer. I would like to that Sweden has more brands in stores, not only online. Like Ulta in the US has like everything. We don't have that in Sweden. We have a chain called Kix, but they have they have so much more online than in stores and I would really want that so yeah but I think everything I want I can get it's just a question about money question number 11 uh, what is the thing you really want to buy but you never buy because it's too expensive and I don't know it's... I'm not as interesting in such expensive brand like Dior or Chanel or Natasha Denona or Path McGrath or Charlotte Tilbury or by Terry or anything. I'm not that into expensive brands. And the last question is, if there was a beauty product genie, who could grant you one wish? What would you wish for? Product genie who would grant you a wish? What? would you wish for? I, I would wish for a super foundation. Like a foundation you put it on and it comes on with foundation, contour, blush and highlighter at the same time. You just swoop it all over your face and your face is done. I love to put on blushes and highlighters sometimes. Sometimes I just wanted to be there. So you little genie, just give us a super foundation that fix or give us the super base. So you just put it on and everything is like the eyebrows are on, the foundation is on, the concealer is on. That I was, we would wish for us. Like a base product, just one. A base product it is everything and then you just have to do your lips and your eyes yeah that will never happen and never ever but if it should come I would buy it I don't know how it would work with all the different colors but it's a genie and he should know how to fix that <laughs> so this was the makeup wish list tag and I think this is a fun tag and I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please press like did it there and also subscribe to my channel if you're not and I will of course leave Danielle's channel and video down in the description box and also the question if you want to do it yourself so I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one bye